Robinhood receives a Wells notice from the SEC and a new group to guard against hacks. You're watching Coindesk Daily. I'm your host, Jen Sinassi. Robinhood shares fell as news broke that the popular trading platform received a Wells notice from the SEC on March 4th. The stock fell about 2.5% in pre-market trading on Monday. In a filing, Robinhood said the potential action from the agency may include a civil injunctive action, public administrative proceeding, and or a cease and desist proceeding. Wells notices are preliminary warnings informing respondents of the charges the regulator is considering against them. They usually lead to enforcement actions. Robinhood ended all support for tokens named in SEC lawsuits brought against Binance and Coinbase in June last year. According to a report co-developed by Visa, more than 90% of stablecoin transaction volumes aren't coming from genuine users. Out of about $2.2 trillion in total transactions in April, just $149 billion originated from organic payments activity. The analysis removed transactions done by bots and large-scale traders to, quote, isolate those made by real people. Visa's head of crypto, Kai Sheffield, said in a note last month that there's a lot of noise in this data, given that blockchain are general purpose networks where stable coins can be used across a range of use cases with transactions that can be initiated manually by an end user or programmatically through bots. Despite the discrepancy between transfer volume and bot adjusted transfer volume, the analysis found a steady growth of monthly active stable coin users. And crypto has a neighborhood watch to guard against hacks. Crypto ISAC is the industry's first information sharing and analysis center. The full roster of Crypto ISAC's founding members who are providing financial support for the organization will be revealed on stage at Coindesk's Consensus 2024. Included in the list are two of the biggest exchanges, a major stablecoin issuer, and one of the best known custody firms. Get your tickets to Consensus 2024 at consensus2024.coindesk.com. That's a wrap for Coindesk Daily. Get more updates on coindesk.com and we'll see you next time.